tonight is the fourth night of Hanukkah, and my son Ryan has come from the Philadelphia area mm -hmm. to visit us for the holidays, and he came just in time because it's Hanukkah! It's Hanukkah. Yay! Yay! <laughs> So when I was growing up, we had a tradition in my house that my father started. Every, every Hanukkah night that my mother would light the candles because it's the woman's job to light the Hanukkah candles. So my mother would gather all of us in the kitchen by the counter, sort of like this. And my father would come in and he'd say, okay, everybody needs to wear a hat. Now, technically, I think it's just the men who needed to wear a hat. And my dad didn't want to go get yarmulkes out of his drawer. So he came up with another idea and he started this when my middle brother and I were both little kids and it continued on even after my youngest brother was born. And for as long as the three of us kids lived at home, this is how things happened on Hanukkah night. So instead of yarmulkes, we all put dish towels on our heads. That was our hat. Even my mother had to wear a dish towel, and it was a family tradition. So in memory of my dad, we're going to do the same thing. So let me light the candles. And this is the shamas. And with the shamas, we light the other candles. Now the menorah is probably turning in a different direction from the way we have it. Um, the candles start on the right side of the menorah and go to the left. Happy Hanukkah! Hanukkah! Hanukkah. <laughs>